Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick. We are back, and I'm sorry we haven't had Nova for a couple of days. I just didn't have time, and we needed to get back into things. So, I've been grinding out Sork, put a bunch of effort into her, and so now it is time to get back to Nova. I don't know what my character is doing here. Um, but yes, it is Nova time. Like the title says, gear swap has been made. We got the Kaposha back on the Sork, and over here I did a lot of inventory cleanup because, boy, did it need it over here. Uh, so now we have Ultimate Agarian Armor on here, as well as Honorary Combatants Gloves, because I really didn't think... There is no 4 set effect, so you don't need the 4th thing. So I didn't feel like it was, po it was pointless to buy it. I mean, I know the casting speed does absolutely nothing for her. It's not a big deal, but I... Yeah, we might as well have this set on here. I have it on my... Had it on my Sork. We upgraded that to boss armor, so we did not need it anymore. We also picked up Treant Spirit's Whispering Earrings and Forest Eye Earrings. Those are our two earrings now. We have a Sula's Crimson Eye Necklace uh, 1. I don't even remember what was it. Pry. We have Red Sand Crystal Ring. We have a Duo Asula's Crimson Eye Ring. And then we have a Tri Asula's Crimson Eye Belt. That should pretty much... This gear should be pretty good enough to get us all the way to the desert in Valencia. If it doesn't get us to the desert in Valencia, I would be absolutely shocked. Uh, let me kill this orc first, and then we'll talk to this exhausted soldier. I believe she gives you a little side quest here for killing orcs, which is perfect. We also got a bunch of money. Um, I don't... I think I put it in the... No, there's actually 27 million still on this character. So yes, we definitely are doing good on money. I've, obviously, I share them between the two accounts. Um, but we're saving up for gear on the Sork, really. So I don't know how gear upgrades are going to work on Nova, but we'll see. We'll get it figured out. I still need to figure out the best way to play this Nova, because... As much as I like it, it's kind of awkward. I need to do more of the, of this, the X, to get me, okay, that's not what I wanted to do, to get me to the actual mob. I mean, I could just do the slam, I mean, I'm trying to figure out, like, what can you do out of it? Can you, I know you can do the B, which is not bad, like the, let's see here, you do... Hey, can you can you do me the whole way? There we go. Yeah, you do like the shield bash out of it, which is not bad, but I don't know if it's the best thing that I should be doing right now. I really, not that I want to get into the habit of button mashing because that's what gets me in trouble, is I get to like, oh, let me just button mash here, which I definitely don't want to be doing anymore. I want to actually, you know, learn the combos, do the combos correctly and go from there. So, we need to look for, looks like, collect red or oh, just clubs, so we just need to kill red orcs. But yes, I don't want to get into the habit of, um, just button mashing, because that's just not good. That's bad. And it, it results in, you know, bad habits, and then when I have to do combos later on... And I understand that later on I'm going to be using the Awakened Nova stuff, but it's still, like, don't get too dependent on... Even if the combo is ugly and it doesn't look right, I need to do something that's not just slam the same button. Like, that, that's good. I, I like that. If I'm going to spam something, I need to spam this. Because it, it works. It gets the job done. Okay, so we're almost 29. I think I could farm these guys to 30. I might be wrong. I don't know how much. Oh yeah, I forgot Dasker. I don't think I can kill. Well, I don't know. I have some really good gear. I might actually be able to fight him. I mean, I don't know. We're here. Let's try it. can't see his health is the annoying part. So I don't even know... I don't know if I've done any damage whatsoever, but I have, like, good gear. The level is just the issue. I'm slower level. So 
I don't know. I don't know how much damage we're doing to him. If we're being honest, but... See, like, against... Okay. I hate that attack. It's so freaking stupid. So stupid. Can you... Oh my gosh, that attack is so dumb. So ridiculous. Okay. Because you get hit by it, like, four times. I might not be strong enough to kill him. I, I don't know. I don't know how... I don't know how hard he is here. And I would prefer not to die, so I don't... Okay, took a lot of damage there. Okay, probably... Okay, we're, we're bailing. I'm bailing. I'm bailing. I'm bailing. I tried it. I don't think... If I could see his health and I knew he was, like, a third of the way to being dead, I probably would continue. But I don't know how close he is to dying. He could be, like, at full health still. Dude, Dastard Beg, leave me alone. Seriously, buddy, leave me alone. Okay. Over here we go. Like, I just, yeah, I'm getting, I'm getting more and more used to this. It, it feels a little bit... You can... I like the glide effect or the gliding that she kind of does with her that forward dash because you can do it a lot it's got like a two second cooldown or something like that that thing it's got like a two second cooldown i like i like it i don't know how useful it is but i kind of like it i just gotta get i just gotta get used to it i'm still getting used to playing the game again so I just got a lot of I got I got work to do, but the more I play this, the more I'm getting used to it. Doesn't feel as awkwardly clunky as it did. Like, see, that was pretty good. You dashed into it, slammed them. Dude, where are you going? I need like a clump. I need to go find like a cluster of them. Here we go. I'm kind of getting the range down on this attack. But even, like, that dash into the right trigger, that's not bad at all, either. Oops, that's not... I did not want to click the stick. Uh, what am I doing? Pull out your weapon. Yeah, Blackstone, that's not bad. I totally missed... I was aiming for that wizard. Totally with that. Fifty-nine percent. We'll get to sixty, and then I probably will try and progress this after this video. I'll probably try to make a big progression jump. I know I said I was going to do that last time, but this time I'm, I'm serious. I'm going to make the, I'm going to make the progression jump, complete the story. Hopefully, we come back and I'll be like mid forties. That's the goal. I don't know if I'm going to make that happen, but tomorrow's video because we're gonna do back-to-back -back novas because i did like three sorts in a row I can't that I missed him okay i'm gonna work my way back now because i think by the time we work our way back we'll be yeah we'll get to 30 i think is that a person yeah it was I thought that was Dastard Beg again. I saw the colors, the colors of their name, and I was like, "What is happening?" Okay, throw that there. Okay, I got stuck on a pot. Okay, but I did attract all those guys from behind, so that's fine. Dude, you just had to come here. Right now, I'm I'm almost to thirty. I just wanted to get to thirty. They, give, they still give like a percent, which is still fairly good. Okay, we're almost there. I think if we just go up here on this hill, we should complete it. I think there's enough guys up here. So you can kind of, you can kind of combo that. You can get pretty good distance on that. More than I feel like you... 
I feel like it looks like. You can get a lot more distance on that. Okay, so there's level 30. Let's go over here and finish this quest off. I think it's kill more orcs immediately. Yeah, defeat red orc wizards, red orc huts. I probably should have just done this. They still give us good experience. Hold on. Let me slap one. Actually, yeah, they give us good experience still, so that's fine. Might just be a Red Orc video, because I think there's something after this, too, for Red Orcs. Yeah, I'm starting to get it. I'm starting to get the flow a little bit better. It's still a little awkward, I understand that. It still looks a little awkward, but... I think I think we're getting there. We're getting there to better. Why is my what is happening to my camera? That tree was like screwing with my camera left and right. It was awkward. All right, finish off the wizard. Destroy this hut. I remember when we it, this used to be like like whenever when this was like brand new and this initial like part here was ridiculous you couldn't get like there were like none of these huts that would ever be respawned because there were so many people trying to do the one singular quest that it gave you that it just created an absolute nightmare oh we're back by dastard bag i'm gonna come over here away from dastard bag What I really want to do is get used to Black Desert so that I don't have to, like, some of the some of the stuff when I'm trying to do a combo, I'm, like, kind of focused super hard and I'm not talking anymore. What am I missing? With, oh, with two wizards. Okay, there's a wizard up here. That, oh my gosh, that tree screws with that camera so bad. What is it doing? What is my character doing? Um... Let's see. There is a bunch of wizards over here. The wizard backed out of my hit. Okay, so let's go. I think we got halfway to 31. Might be good enough. I think the next part is we come over here, we talk to this dude, and I believe he gives us another quest pertaining to killing orcs. I might be wrong, but I, I think he does. But we gotta, this, this series is gonna take forever to get to like anything exciting if I keep doing like every episode like this. So that's why I'm saying that we gotta, I gotta have a skip episode where we're like, okay, we made huge progression and here's where we are now. The gear and everything will be the same. So it's just a matter of like where on earth we are on the map. And I feel like you guys don't need to see me doing all of this. Wait, which one am I? I need to talk to this guy. I'm gonna get hit out of right. this. Oh no, it's gonna let me stay. Okay. I'll just eat the hits. Yeah, see, now we need to kill 60 orcs. I mean, that was a... I, I mean, I don't know if that's considered a combo for this, but it felt like a combo. I'm gonna be honest, it felt like a combo. Maybe it wasn't, but it felt like it. It was decent. I like the ice part of her. I'm really interested. I only have looked at, like, oh, like a trailer video. I don't really know how the, um... How the awakening works for her so i'm really interested in that and i've already started doing a little pre-planning i think if i don't fall in love with nova awakening we're gonna try ranger for the first time because i have not done ranger awakening and it was like one of the things i was most excited to do was play ranger awakening but we never got there on ps4 and so i feel like i gotta we gotta give it a go I feel like I don't have a choice. I, I, I gotta give it a go. If if this doesn't work out. Because I want to have two characters. I love my Sork, but... 
I feel like I can't grind on Sork every single day of every of every day. Like, I just can't play Sork every day for the rest of the time. I gotta find a second character to play. And if I can find the second character, that'd be great. Then we can just do videos on two characters, and that would be great. But we gotta figure out a second character. I have a feeling Nova's gonna get gonna get there. Which I'll still probably play a Ranger to Awakening because I want to see how it works, but I don't think I'll have to if I don't want to. Because I think this Nova's going to be good. I like, I'm starting to, I used to hate the this Nova, like, pre-Awakening, but I'm kind of starting to like it now, and the Awakening thing was what I was most excited for anyway. So I, I'm thinking when we get there, it's going to be good. I'm going to be happy with it. I'm kind of worried about Sork and Kama because I don't know if I, I don't know if I'm good enough to like do Kama because I was doing some stuff there and it was like eh, not quite really doing enough damage that I think well I didn't think I was doing enough damage. Okay, so we got to 31. He's he's over there, but you got to cross the bridge. Where is it trying to take me there if I jump off? Okay. Hello? I just completely whiffed everything. Sorry. Right. There's some points like... Like with... Like, uh, like this, the X ability... You Okay, can't hit him. The X ability, you want to be kind of accurate with it. And it's one of the things, like, with a controller... Makes it a lot harder than if I had a mouse and keyboard to be accurate with. I guess just a mouse, but yeah, it'd be a lot easier with the mouse to aim. Okay, Restless Days didn't accept the quest. I don't remember if th this might not be a kill quest. Actually, I think this is the boss. Is this the boss? No, it's not because it would say. Okay, yeah, now, okay, it's still a kill quest. See, I knew I picked a good spot to come back in, because this is just the orc episode. Okay, so there's Ryan's name tag. There's another name tag. Who do we still... Uh, let's go over here. So we're looking for specific long red orcs. Is that what we're looking for? Um, I guess... Okay, so there's Carl's name tag, or Fighter, there's Kusto's name tag, and we're missing... I mean, I'll kill these things, but where's the last enemy type that we... to get Bellix's name tag? Um, I don't see any of whatever it is. Um, let's go back this way, see if I can figure out what... Ah, here we go. Looks like... Whatever this is. This is a regular... Oh, and I got it on the first kill. Nice. Nice and easy. I know the boss is coming up, so this actually works out. It's just an orc killing video. If you can't tell, I'm wearing a polo. I went to work today and I came home. So this is getting recorded. So this is getting recorded at 6.30 right now. 7 o'clock... Or 8 o'clock is when this is going to try to go live. So this actually worked out well. Because if I had to do a bunch of in between stuff i don't think it would have worked okay so here we go boss greedy overlord so i'm gonna talk to this guy real quick i think he has i think he has like an easier orc quest for me collect red mushrooms from firewood orcs yeah let's let's do this because can i pull out my weapon like hello character was just jumping around like an idiot Okay, so there's the blue mushroom. And there's the red mushroom. Yeah, see, I told you that was going to be a real easy quest. I think I'm going to push the 33 and then we'll go kill the boss. And then we'll call it an episode. I think that works. So grab that. That is another quest. Uh, destroy... Okay, red orc prisons. Okay. So I'll cross across here again. I think there's, yeah, there's prisons all over. Hello? I 
through the axe and it didn't do anything. And then that one went way past the rest of the show. Can you stop spinning the wind? Okay, so we gotta go find prisons. I see a bunch of them on the map. We're at 75%, which is good. So there's two. There's two more. I wish you could curve that. So if you could do... Let's see. If you could do this skill... Hold on. Let it come back. Okay, if you could do this skill right here, and when it does that slam, if you could turn it, your camera and angle it, that thing would be elite. I wonder if you can angle it. Hold on. Can you angle it with your spot? Screw that up. Hold on. I'll let it cool off, and then we'll try it again. Because if you can turn it, that's ridiculously good. For me. For, like, what I do, it'd be ridiculously good. So, if you do this... Yeah, you can't turn it. If you could turn your momentum there and, like, slam it off to the left. I'm not even asking for, like, like, um, full, like, range of motion there to do, like, a 360 turn. I'm just asking for any amount of turn. Like, a little bit of turn so you could readjust that. I think that would be very helpful. Okay. Hello? Can I aim? Cross back, cross the bridge we go. And it didn't... I don't know why it does that sometimes. It's like it... It's like it has like a brain fart and it can't throw it. Now I'm having a brain fart and I can't fight anymore. Okay. Kill, kill... We're almost there. And there we go, 33. Nice. Okay. Adventurer. Complete that quest. Nice. Okay. So I think it's time we kill the we kill the boss and we call it an episode. I feel as though that was a very successful episode. Like we progressed a lot of levels, like five levels or something like that. I feel like that's fairly good. Like, I don't feel like we progress five levels, like, very often in a video. So I feel like we did good. And then next episode, we'll come back. I'll I'll grind for a few. I'm going to watch uh, some Resident Evil Village streams tonight. And uh, I'll grind out this character a little bit. Maybe I'll even get her to 45. I don't know. I don't know how much I want to skip. But I'll grind it out. And then I'll record tomorrow's video after I get off work. Um, and we'll, we'll go from there. Have a short day tomorrow. Just, uh, what, 10 to, 10 to 2, 10 to 2 tomorrow. So when I get home at 2, I'll grind out another Nova video for you guys, and then I'll get Sunday's video recorded as well. We might do three Novas in a row, and then we'll, we'll hop back to Sork. I don't know. I'll have to figure it out. But I'll get it, I'll get it all worked out. Because Sork is on camera now, which will be fun. I kind of forgot how far of a run this is. But this is fine. I just up it you guys. So, yeah. Sork's on camera now. So, we'll have to see. I'm not quite sure. Camera's going to be interesting. Because I feel like I'm a little under. I think I just suck. Like, I just am not that good enough at the game. I think that's the issue. I think my gear is perfectly fine for camera. But... I am on a little bit of a struggle on camera, but we'll see. I've, I'm not too deep into it yet, so we'll see how it goes. I'm always I'm always game for a challenge, so if I gotta... And it's probably good that I reach a challenge because it means I gotta hone my skills a little bit, get a little better, work on work on playing better. So it, it's probably be for the best that I get slammed a few times on Sork. Because the the finishing up Valencia crap that we were doing, that just felt like... I just felt like Zeus. Nothing could touch me. And I was doing a billion damage to everything. So we'll see how it goes with Sork Awakening. I know I gotta get my movement... Or Sork Succession. I know I gotta get my movement down better. Because I have terrible movement. And that's a huge part of Sork Succession is that it's super mobile. So gotta work on that. 
I'm assuming we're gonna like four shot this guy because our gear is like I don't know what you consider end game. So like mid, mid, it's not really. Well, it all depends on what you consider what. It's like late game. It's it's like late game gear for the story. It's not late game for the late game, but you know what I mean. Okay, let's slam him. You guys know I love a good a rambling session. Those those who watch for a long time, you guys know I love a good rambling session in a video. And, okay, one combo. <laughs> one combo is all it took to kill him. So let's summon Black Spirit. I didn't turn that quest in, so I'll go back and turn that in. And, uh, yeah. So we got all sorts of new... Ooh, we got all sorts of, like, fun stuff here. I don't really care about those. Those boxes are kind of pointless, but it's whatever. Sure, give me that box. Complete that quest. Um, and then the world from above. I think this is our main quest. Is it? Yes. Go to the Delphi Knight Castle. That's completing Serendia, so we're all good with that. I did move all of the stuff, all the extra, like, garbage that I had for characters and whatnot. It's now in Hydel, which I think is good to be... Where am I in the world now? Hydel, right here. So when you get done with the main story, or the beginning of the game, you can come right down here to Hydel, and I'll have gear waiting for myself for future characters. I think that's that's best. Uh, instead of having... I used to have it in Altanova, which is way over here. And that just makes no sense, because then a character comes here and I have to run them all the way to Altanova and then run them all the way back. So Heidel makes more sense to keep all my central hub stuff. Then I only have to run, like, one or two characters there. But uh, that's going to do it for this video, guys. I hope you all enjoyed. Drop a like if you did, subscribe if you have not, and I will catch you all in the next one. Peace! Cause when it's all over, Yeah.